In contrast to Google Analytics, Facebook is about your community and it's about the people engaging with your content and about engaging with each other. What this means is that when you're looking at the data from Facebook, you're seeing the emergence, or otherwise, of your community, of the community of buyer personas that's being developed and being built around your content and around those engagements that you're encouraging and you're developing through the different social media networks. Facebook is only part of that, of course, but the analytics that you're seeing, demographic information, for example, is providing with an inf uh, a guide and a hopefully reassurance around the demographics you believe your buyer persona possesses. Clearly, the feedback that you can take from Facebook is a confirmation or otherwise of that demographic, but also confirmation or otherwise of whether the content and the engagements that you're encouraging are suitable for that buyer persona. This is where the feedback loop occurs and you actually can take corrective actions around your activity to build and improve your community. The community that is developing will encourage and push you in that direction, not just through their comments and feedback, but through what they do and reveal via the Facebook analytics that you can see. This means that in terms of Facebook, you can react and respond quickly to differences, changes in the community and feedback from the community that encourages you to help build that community to be stronger and to be a stronger brand advocate for you. In terms of Facebook statistics, we use it a little bit. We look and see what reach some of our messages actually have out there, but it's not the most responsive in terms of our sector and our industry, but that might differ elsewhere. Yes, we are using uh, Facebook Insights, where you can find a lot of information about demographics and interests for your fans, but also we are using custom uh, analytics, actually combining Facebook with Google Analytics, in order to see uh, how people coming from Facebook performing to our website. Numerous times I've heard customers in our stores asking about specific products that, that, was, that were posted on our page and they've come to purchase them. 